Well, hello to all of my May flowers and welcome back to my channel. It's already May here, but you already know that. I don't know why I do that same intro every single time. It's just something that works for me. You guys all know who I am. Eventually, I'll change up my intro, but for now, this works for me, so, yeah. So, anyways, as you can tell by the title of the video, this is my most anticipated video game releases. I don't know how many parts this is going to be, so... Just stay tuned for the video. This is, I'm going to be doing my most anticipated video game releases of 20 of, I don't know when all these games are coming out. Some of them I know the dates, some of them I don't. All I know is they're games I'm beyond excited for. Cannot wait for them to come out. I would say some of the games now, but you'll see later in the video. And this is obviously going to go in two parts. Because I have several pictures I'm going to show. No clips, just pictures. So yeah, I hope you all enjoy this and stay tuned for more videos. What's going on everyone? It's Ari Me here, as you already know. As I said at the beginning of this video, this is my most anticipated video game releases of this coming this year and the coming year. And the first game I'm gonna be reviewing, or not reviewing, but talking about here, is The Walking Dead Season 3, the video game. Now, I don't know if any of you are as big of fans of this game as I am, but a few years ago, I was going through the app score on my phone. I found season one, had never heard of the game, and then downloaded it, played episode one, A New Day, and then fell in love ever since, bought it for my PS3. I have beaten this game so many times on PS3 and PS4, and as well as my cell phone. And anyways, I'm going to talk about this game. As you can tell, I kind of talked through the first two pictures. Two or three, I don't remember. But anyways, the graphics in this game are just phenomenal compared to the first two. And I just, I cannot explain my excitement for this game. We saw the trailer for it a few weeks ago at E3 on the IGN channel. Go ahead and check that out. But here you get a look at the zombie. Which is compared to the zombies from the first game, or walkers as they're called in The Walking Dead. Walkers from the first game, second game, and now is just phenomenal how much how far they've come just within a matter of a few years. And as we all know in this first in this game, we are about four years from the original outbreak date. And as you can see here, this is where Clementine shoots the zombie. I'll get to talk about that in a moment, but we know we are about four years past the first, like, the outbreak date, from, so when a new day happened in, epi in season one, the game, to now, we're about four years apart, in, epi in season one, Clementine was eight turning nine, second game, she was pre-teen, 11, 12, this game, she is teenager, 13 to 15 range, as you can see here in this clip, Clementine, you've probably all seen this in the trailer, and this is a very talked about subject. Clementine lost a finger. What did she lose a finger from? Was it a walker attack? There's been so much that has happened. <coughs> Sorry about that. But there's been so much. There's a two-year gap from the past two games, so wonder what's all happened. We all know in this game that... Like I said, there's a two-year gap, so there's so much to be explained. And in season two, obviously, what if there's there was like four or five different ending possibilities for season two. So obviously, what you choose in season two as your ending is going to have an effect on something in season three. Obviously, <coughs> what that is, we have no idea yet. We will find out when the game comes out this fall, and. But also, as you could tell here, Clementine and her new partner, I think it's Hiver, I, I honestly can't remember how to pronounce it, but there's going to be two playable characters in this game as IGN and E3 and Telltale all confirmed a few weeks ago at E3. And I'm, just, I'm so curious, as I'm sure as everyone else is, to see the storyline in this game. The new character has never been... <clears throat> in the show or in any of the comic books, so he's completely new to the game, so I'm very curious to see what role he's going to play in it. As you all can all tell here, it comes out this fall. I cannot wait for them to release an actual date. 
I'm sure it'll be probably late fall, maybe early winter when it comes out. But I'm just so curious over the next few months to see what spoilers they're going to release and see what just everything they're going to release from the game. I am so excited. Just, uh, I truly cannot explain my excitement for this game. I started off with this game because it is hands down my most anticipated release coming out probably over the next few years. And as you can tell here coming up, I did a little collage here of Clementine from the past three games. In the top one is season one, where she was about eight or nine. And in the middle one, season two, and season three at the bottom. Alrighty, hope you enjoyed.